welcome to our show. This is Ina Santander speaking. I'm here with my partner, uh, Matthew. Hi, Matthew. Hi, good to see you again. Hi, um, so he has, uh, what do you have in store for us today? Uh, I'm selected some luxurious hotel and some a bit less luxurious. <laughs> called me range. Um, so uh, let me just tell you a little bit about myself. I'm in at saint andéol I've been an interior designer for 20 years working all over the world, especially for high brand. And uh, don't forget to follow us. If you have any comments, please put them down and I will reply to you as soon as I can. So let's start. Okay, so we are in Asia. Are we? In London. This is London? Yeah, an hotel about 500 pounds a night. 500 pounds? That's a not night. too bad. Wow, London has changed so much now. Huh? We have to go back. I have to go back there. I studied there. And um, all these buildings didn't exist at the time. Well, that makes me feel so old. <laughs> well, this interior is. Um, a little bit like Asian inspired, it feels with those flowers, a bit of gold. To be honest, um, it's it looks comfy enough. I would you stay there for 500 a night? Uh, too expensive for me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, he doesn't have the money to do that. So, moving on to the next one. Uh, okay, that's a lot more mid range. This one, exactly, it could be better for my money. <laughs> Yeah, and if you want to invite people, you can always uh, put them in the corner there with just a lamp over it so you can have a Spanish uh, inquiry there. Still in London. It's still in London, okay. Yeah, it's expensive there. Uh, whew, there's a mama poster on the wall with London. Oh, those sales like hot pancakes, those ones. But seriously, I, I don't like it. I. I think uh, being a painter, you should put paintings on the walls and uh, give them uh, give the painters money, <laughs> especially uh, if you're a hotel. I think a painter could bring a bit of um, of emotions, right? Ooh, I didn't see the floor. There's a bit of a brush strokes happening there. Whoa, that's a lot more luxurious. I imagine they put gold. It's uh, the, the George Five in okay. Paris, and definitely I can afford to sleep over there. Two hundred, two thousand a night. Two thousand a night, but we can go and have a tea there for about hundred. Even for the tea. <laughs> well, we're sure. supposed to go to Paris next week, and we'll definitely check it out. Um, it's uh, it's it's old fashioned. I think that's what you would expect from George Five. I don't like the mix of the cushion and uh, the armchair. And the armchair was the, the, the old fashioned pattern there with a tapestry on the wall. I mean, again, like uh, if you put something a little bit more uh, modern, like from a painter, it would bring out all the old elements you have in this hotel. And I don't think, I think people will still see it as an expensive hotel. Well, I'll tell you more in next week when we go. Okay, um, we have a hotel in uh, No Opinion Land. Where are we? We are in, still in Paris, but a mid-range uh, hotel. A mid-range hotel? Ah, I wouldn't say so. I wouldn't have thought so. Is there a Chanel over there? Um, chandeliers. Oh, chandeliers. I like the walls, like made of um, of this old stone. It's beautiful. The chandeliers, it's a uh, it's a big no-no for me. And bring a bit of colors. I mean, just beige and beige and rata beige. Whoa, <laughs> that looks expensive, but is it? what a night we're gonna have there. <laughs> this is uh, I, is it is it uh, in Dubai? Yeah. <clears throat> yes, I recognize those uh, cushion. <laughs> this is, like, well, again, they're showing their wealth, but in a manner that nothing is. The most expensive hotel in Dubai, 1,300 a night. 1,000? 1, yeah, 300. I'm surprised, it doesn't seem expensive. 
Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I can't afford it, but still, it doesn't seem expensive. Anyway, this. You feel like a king there, a king in a medieval um, era. So, okay, I'm moving on. There's just really nothing I can do. Okay, we're in New York. Exactly. Uh, this is beautiful. I I like it. Um, I don't I don't like the uh, the bed runner. Seriously, Ina de Saint Andre makes this beautiful bed runner, and it will bring soul emotion to this interior. Like watching the crystal building, I think uh, I think you can't afford that. The Hotel Millennium Hilton in New York, five hundred a night. That's not too bad. I'm surprised at those prices. Okay, now we are in a youth hotel. Okay, well that doesn't it's feel romantic. Four, it's forty dollars a night. Forty dollars. Well, it depends on its location. And I hope it's windows behind those because the ceiling is so low. Again, then we have blue, white and red. I don't like this combination of colors. Um, but it seems clean enough. Whoa, that's sad. Madrid. Luxurious hotel in Madrid. I'm surprised because um, Madrileans, they really like, uh, they like bright colors. What happened today? It looks like the thing has been washed out. I can't do anything for you guys, I'm sorry. Okay, now uh, we're moving to... Uh, Madrid as well. I was going to say Madrid. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's fine enough. A bit more colours. I like the green. They should have added more greens here and there as a reminder. Maybe in the, in the cushions as well. Don't underestimate the uh, power of the cushions. They are... Uh, they definitely can uh, can bring colors, but in small amount touches, and uh, and in this space, it would be uh, definitely needed. Oh, it's done. Okay, I hope you liked the show. Don't forget to follow us, and I uh, I see you next time. Bye, bye, see Matthew. You, Lina.